back from my tattoo appointment. Completely forgot to even vlog me getting a tattoo, but it didn't take that long. So I was like, eh, why even bother? Excuse this right here. It's just some paintings I want to put away in the closet, but I'm too lazy to go and dig into the closet in order to put them away. The struggle is real, I guess. But yeah, I got another little tattoo on my leg. My last vlog, my last tattoo vlog was the chain I got on my leg. And then I got a little like Grim Reaper scythe this time. Uh, the last time I got tattooed though, I did get this. As I mentioned in my Where I've Been video. But yeah, I'll just show you the tattoo now. Boom. Here's the new tattoo. It's small, but I just got it to fit this awkward space on my leg right here. And I'm eventually gonna get this spot filled too. I'm gonna get this space filled too. And then this space, and like I said, the big piece on the back of my leg, and then I'll basically be all done. I'll probably get something right here too just to like balance it out since I have something here. Yeah, I'm just really happy with it. I will show it tomorrow once I take the um, Saniderm off and I wash it. And then I'll make a video about how I heal my tattoos. It is day two and I'm about to wash the tattoo for the first time and peel off the Saniderm. Pretty excited to see how it looked because I haven't really looked at it that much. I had work last night, so I couldn't really like look at it and get used to it. My dog is currently in the bathroom with me because there's a thunderstorm going on right now and she's super scary. All right, so if you're a little bit squirmish, I wouldn't watch this part, but this is what it looks like before I take the sand derm off really nasty looking, grosses me out too. So here it is after I wash it. Sorry, it's upside down. <laughs> like it really does fit the theme of my leg, especially since I have like a little Grim Reaper below it. 